Hi, I'm Patricia Beagle, and I'm currently attending Cuba College. I plan on majoring in accounting, and I am on the last week in my first semester, aka probably the most stressful week you'll encounter during the semester. Um, I was asked to give this inspirational video with advice for the incoming freshmen next year, and what I'm going to say can basically be split up into two topics, from the education point of view and from the social life point of view. So, starting with educational, the best advice I can give is do not make things harder than they have to be. You know, leaving high school and coming into college, you get told by your previous teachers that it's going to be so much harder and you have to do 10 times more of the work. But that's completely wrong. Um, I know I took all these notes thinking I'm going to need every single piece of information and I spent a lot of hours on these notes and those were that was time wasted. Um, also with when you receive projects or essays, you are gonna receive a rubric and it has all the requirements on it, but so many people end up putting extra detail into it and it, you're gonna get the same grade as someone that also met their requirements but didn't put that extra time and detail into it. So it's going to be stressful if you're getting the same grade even though you feel like you should have gotten better because you know that person put in less time than you. So I would say you have to find your happy medium. You don't want to overload your time with one project. Like you don't want to be working on that one project for hours and hours but you also don't want to do too little. So you have to find that perfect time where you can get the grade that you want without exerting too much energy into it. Um, from a social life point of view, you gotta make friends. And obviously that's easy said, but not so easily done. I came into college banking on the fact that hopefully I'd be friends with my roommate. And even though we're on good terms, we just don't really click. So I was just constantly like in my dorm just watching Netflix or doing homework or being asleep and then you'd wake up and basically repeat your day and that was that was a downer basically because you're at college to make all these new experiences and I was just stuck in my dorm not doing anything so my advice for that is to join the CUCA Facebook page for your class so I'm in the class of 2024 so that's the Facebook group page I'm in the problem is I never took the initiative to start adding people on social media and making friends before I got to college. I thought it would be easy. I thought I'd be like, I could just wait till I get to college. I don't have to add all these people right now. But I was wrong. Like, you want to make friends before you get there. Because when you get there, you're going to start being homesick. And it's just going to mentally be beneficial if you already have friends that can be your backbone. Because chances are they're going to be feeling the same way you are. Um, another way to make friends is go to the social events. You know, Cuba puts on a lot of events for us students. And even though you may think that, oh, this is going to be stupid, like, I found my friends at a suicide prevention walk. And I don't know what I would do if I didn't, like, go to that event because... I would still be sitting in my room thinking that the college experience isn't all that great. So you will definitely want to go to those events. Um, I mean, you're basically paying for it. The student activities group is what puts them on and you pay towards that group. So just always go to those events. They're going to be worth your while. Um, so yeah, those are my big pieces of advice. And have a good first year. Always feel available to reach out to me. You can look me up on social media. And, yeah. Thanks for listening.